What is going on, everybody? It is Wednesday, flawless football release day. We did not get any. I've always never been able to do well for myself into it. And for the price, for the bang, sometimes you just don't do well. But I did what I said. I add some stuff to the store, about, I don't know, about 18 different items here. So I'm going to go through just to show you all. If you're all looking for stuff that was in the store, it's no longer there. It's because it's on eBay right now on auction, like that LeBron James. I think it's up to a buck twenty or something now. I will have a link to the description below in case you do want to look at the eBay auctions for this week. I don't do a whole lot of auctioning on eBay. It's normally maybe once a month I'll throw 10 to 15 cards have been sitting in the store for a while that I want to move. So, uh, yeah, basically if you want to check it out, you can. I'll put a link in the description. I know some people ask me about my – or you can just go to the website. Uh, extremecarbreaks.com on the top of the menu will say, I think it's like auctions or eBay auctions, something like that. You can click on that, it'll take you there too. But I'll put a link in the description. I think I do already, but just on a safe side. So I packaged together. This is a lot of Gypsy Queen. There's only two basketball cards, which I'll save to the end. These are going to be hard to see. All right. I packaged up four of these. These are Bo Bichette's, which is really hard to tell. I'm going to have to pull it back. Here we go. Four of his rookie cards packed up into one. One lot, I guess you could say. And everything has been priced a little bit lower than eBay. So what I could find as the average comp. This is a two-pack of Bichette's rookies. So you get two in this one, four in the other. Like I said, it's all in the store now. Bichette Chrome. That's the Gypsy Queen Chrome card. Very nice. I packaged both these together. It's a Gypsy Queen logo swap of Bichette. So you'll get both. Kevin Biggio, Gypsy Queen logo swap. Danny Jansen, Indigo. This is out of 150. Uh, Randall Grichuk, missing nameplate. I was surprised at what this last one sold on this. There's only been one that's sold, but I was really surprised because I was like, wow. I, I figured it was going to be a little bit cheaper, but you'll see when you see the price. It's about half of what it was on eBay. There's a gold. Chrome Guerrero. I want to say last sold was 30. We have it as 25 in the store. They are numbered out of 50. Some of the prices I do know. This is the blue Chrome of Guerrero out of 150. Regular Chrome Guerrero from Gypsy Queen. Not numbered. Pack of, I believe this is two Guerreros, uh, the fortune tellers. Yeah, two. I'd look at the bottom. So there's two of those in there. This is a lot of Blue Jay stuff. Cause that's what I had in breaks. The mail has been going really slow. Like, I've had stuff mailed out last Monday and Tuesday. It's not even here yet. And just so everybody knows, whether you send first class, priority, they're not guaranteeing times anymore. It could take, you know, 10 days to get to you. So... Just a heads up, it's not me. Uh, Wheel of Fortune, which is a tarot card of Bichette. It's the Indigo. Uh, 250 that's now in the store as well. Pack uh, two of these tarot cards of Bichette. Those are in the store. Triple pack, Bichette uh, Fortune Tellers. And I just have them already packed up just because it's a little bit easier. Kevin Biggio, this is the Bazooka back. Very rare to find those things, and when you get somebody pretty good, it goes up a little bit in value. I did end up putting one Bichette Auto in there. I'm keeping one plus the black and white that I pulled. So that is in the store as well. I just used the medium price range, like the last four or five, I believe. A little fuzz on there. All right. I'm going to explain these. There's two of these. They're separate in the store. Kobe White. This is from Upper Deck. Goodwin Champions. So... I have them numbered, one and two. But when you see the pictures, I put them on the back so we know which one's going to which. If you look at the one on the right, a little bit more off center than the one on the left. So I discount this five bucks just because it's centering on to this one here is a little more better centering. So number two is the better centering. Um, but you'll see it reflected in price. So I did ask some basketball. Upper Deck, great product from years ago. I wish they still made stuff today that had... You know, more of a variety like they did before, SPA, SPX, all that craziness. I really miss them. Plus, they had the Jordan LeBron autos. Uh, even Ben Simmons, they're solely with Upper Deck. 
But two Kobe Whites, these are considered as rookies, and I believe these are supposed to be some kind of, uh, I'm trying to remember what it was worded as, unannounced auto or something like that. So Kobe White was one of the players that were like that on there. So those are both in the store. Like I said, the center one's 30, this one, the other one's 25. But that's what I put in the store, um, just so everybody can see ahead of time. You're like, I don't know what, if he's ever stocked in the store with anything new. I figured I'd do a video just to show what was in there. I just stuck in there today. There's no discounts, nothing like that. I took about, I don't know, 20 items or so out and put them on eBay just to get them out for Friday so we can get some new product in. We should this week have Topps Tribute on Friday. It was shipped today. I'm hoping UPS will stick to their schedule and get here from St. Louis. I'll have a box of 1718 Status Basketball. It was one of the cheaper products that year, but when you start looking at some of the rookies like Mitchell, Tatum, Kuzma, um, I'm missing somebody too. It's either a heater. I think it's a heat guy. Bam. Bam, bam, I call him. Yeah, he's in there and somebody else. There, there's, a, there's a good rookie class. I mean, it's nothing like you're going to find a Zion or Luka type rookie class, but it's a good rookie class. And for the price of the box, I really couldn't be it. So if that comes in Friday, we'll open that live up. Other than that, give you guys a quick show of what's got just been put in the store. It's already in there right now. And then also, if you guys want to look at the eBay auctions, you're more than welcome to as well, too. Uh, but that's about all for a wacky Wednesday, as I called it. I put a big screen TV out without the power cord because the plasma died in. And I've had it for like eight months sitting here. And you only get like one month a year where it's like free anything with our garbage uh, place. So I called him, stuck it out there yesterday, right? It was out there through last night till about 7.30 this morning. That TV was still out there. Somewhere between 7.30 and 10, somebody grabbed that thing. I was like, wow, no power cord, no nothing. I'm like, more power too if you all want to fix it. I mean, to me it was cheaper to buy a new TV. So that's why I called it Wacky Wednesday. Because the neighbor had an older TV out and like people just like went through and picked up people's trash. It was really odd, weird. I didn't think it happened on our street. But other than that, you guys have a safe Wednesday and a good rest of the week. I will be back live, of course, on Friday. Tomorrow we'll look at Topps Tribute. All right, everybody, take care. Have a good day.